do all the activities, my glasses never come off. With giblets. <gasps> With giblets? That means there's babies in there. <sighs> I gotta overcome this. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Good morning guys, welcome back to Basically Nomad's Bus. I'm Devin. And I'm Brianna. And today is Christmas. So Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays. We're just gonna be going through our normal routine. Uh, we are gonna open our gifts and we're also gonna be making a Christmas dinner for two at some point, which could be four. If we end up hanging out with Nick and Lauren, which is another bus couple. Of course, we have to start out the morning like we do every morning with some coffee. So there are a couple things that make Christmas, I think, different in a bus. And one of those is how we do gifts. So you can see right here, we don't have like any presents under the tree. We just do stocking. It's kind of a thing that we decided to do probably like, I don't know, like three or four years ago. We just kind of made an agreement that everything that you get needs to fit in a stocking. And this is the first year that Brie broke that rule because she got something that won't fit in the stocking. Nope. There we go. Actually, that kind of works. And then she got herself one as well. <laughs> so, there we go. That's good enough. Obviously, we have a tiny space, so we can't just have like massive boxes of presents. We can't bring in a bunch of stuff that we're not gonna be using. The other thing is like, you have to know that person wants it. You can't just get something because you think that they want it. It has to be something that they've either been talking about or explicitly said within the year that they want. Just some notes for you guys that might want to do bus life or tiny living at some point. Oh boy, here he comes, yep. Oh my gosh, really Archie? We couldn't have one moment <laughs> without you, could we? <laughs> coffee's ready. It's an important moment in every vlog. I think once coffee's done, we can do some <coughs> stockings. Whoa, you're really getting fancy for the people. Cheers. Cheers, I think it's time. So I gotta take a drink of coffee. I hate Come going on. first. Christmas I open boy. Up my, yeah. All right, remember, so everything had to fit in our stocking. I am a huge believer in buying consumables Yeah. when it comes to tiny living. So when I see gummy bears and like chocolates and stuff, I'm all for it. I love Justin's peanut butter cups. Yeah. Oh, it was in your, it was in Amazon. You had it in there and then you saved it to later. I, it was in Amazon? Yeah. Oh. That's the other thing, you can't get your feelings hurt because then you end up keeping things that you don't need. So like if we don't like something, then we oh, just yeah. send it back, like no problem. And then I didn't know what that was. What? <laughs> what is that? It's lavender paste. <laughs> I so know. I can like spruce up my teas and coffees. Okay, just... so you did want that? Yeah. <laughs> it's lavender extract. Here's a tip for you guys. If you're shopping for your lady and you don't know what to get, go to their Amazon. <laughs> Go to their save for later list and their Pinterest. Those are the two places that you yeah, can find like little hidden true. stuff. Oh, you got me an Apple Watch? <laughs> yeah, I did. Devin, <laughs> you're not supposed to do that. Yeah, we usually don't do things that expensive either. She's been talking about Last an Apple gift. Watch for like a year. Oh, uh, yeah, I knew this one. one. I'm yeah. super, okay, so but forgot. first of all, I forgot and I'm super excited. I hope it's the one that I really want. <gasps> It's the ones that I wanted. That's tight, bro. Yeah, so like, I could do all the activities, my glasses never come <laughs> off. That's true, you could go to a uh, headbanger's ball. Wow. wow, I love these. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. All right. Like okay, okay. okay. Joggers. With big boy stuff, I have to have medium. Obviously, this is like the best thing you can get is the Duluth underwear, I'm telling you. Ladies, if you really want to like, Ladies. if you want to really impress your husband, get him some of these. These things are awesome. Obviously not sponsored. Those things are amazing. They last forever yeah. and they're I'm super I'm wearing some right now. Oh yes. Um, but oh Duluth. yes. Yeah. <clears throat> Thank you. Those are great. Love those. And then I got my big ass brick of soap. What flavor is this? <laughs> smells like navel you supremacy. You say what flavor? <laughs> It's a scent. You don't eat it. You don't know what I do with it. Oh boy. The soap pouch, like any chance I get. What color is it? I guessed blue, black, white, or gray. Whoa! Ha! I did not see orange coming. Ha! Very nice. I like it. Struck you by surprise. You really did. Look at that. Devin, it has to be on my skin! <laughs> Archie, what do you think? Now I'm gonna open mine. Wow! Orange! All right guys, so I think it is now time to start making Christmas dinner. What's on the menu? 
is roasted chicken, mashed potatoes, mac and cheese, and green beans. And then for dessert, I made Oreo balls last night and we've clearly been snacking on them, so. Wait, what do you mean clearly? What do you mean by that? Um, clearly, I mean that Devin is obsessed with Oreo balls and he can't not eat them. Check out these babies. Mm, 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 mm. Let's do it. So let's get out the chicken. I rarely, rarely eat meat. I've never cooked a chicken in my life, and I've never made Christmas dinner in my life. I don't know anything about chicken's anatomy. Roast the chicken breast, blah, blah, blah. With giblets. What does that mean? I don't know. <gasps> With giblets? That means there's babies in there. <laughs> I do not actually think that's what that means. According to Wikipedia, giblets is a culinary term for the edible offal of a fowl. It's, it's pronounced giblets, obviously. This is crazy. Hey. I'm here to help. So I'm gonna mix our like ingredients to pour into the chicken first. Show Erica. Okay, listen to the instructions. It says, <sighs> look for a spot at the chest cavity opening. Do you see it? Bree, I don't think I can do this. I probably feel like a doctor at Grey's Anatomy. I think the giblets are inside of there. <sighs> I gotta overcome this. And pour the lemon butter evenly under the skin between the breasts. Do not throw up, Devin. This is funny. I need a spoon. Give me a dessert spoon. I don't have a dessert spoon. I don't even know what that is. A dessert spoon is a spoon designed specifically for eating dessert. You're kidding me. Oh, okay. We do have one. You let me know in the comments below. Is, is this a, a dessert spoon? Dessert spoon? It's kind of cute. Of course it is. But then it says fill the chicken cavity with lemon quarters. Okay. That adds sound effects on. on all this. We have to fill it with rosemary, but my thing is like, these are really big sprigs. This is like one, this is good. Should okay. I just use this then instead of that big one? Oh gosh, I already chickened it up. You have to tie the legs up. So our chicken is about ready to go in. On top you put paprika, onion powder, and olive oil. Salt this thing looks really good. The giblets, the giblets, right? Have those all right here. So we're gonna try to cook that up and eat that. I don't want to waste it. It feels bad. Next up, we're going to start making everything else, which is the mac and cheese, mashed potatoes, and the green beans. What do people do before potato peelers? This is fantastic. Probably setting some kind of a record. Got our potatoes cut, and potatoes are ready. Bree's getting to work on the green beans, which I will not be eating. I hate them. This is going to be our sweet potatoes because we didn't get regular mashed potatoes like we thought we did. Whoops. And then we're gonna have macaroni and cheese going on the back burner. It's a lot going on at once. All right, we got the macaroni and cheese getting started. All kinds of good stuff in here. There's like milk, onion and garlic powder, flour, butter. salt, butter, everything good. Obviously just like regular elbow macaroni. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh, we only have 25 minutes left on, the, on our chicken already. So we gotta get these potatoes moving. And obviously you can see we have four plates because our friends, Lauren and Nick, are coming over. Okay, so our timer on the potatoes is going. We've got macaroni almost done, probably in like six minutes. Green beans are done in like two. And I think we only have like 10 minutes on our chicken. Everything's coming together at the same time. I planned this really well. Dude, I'm most excited about the macaroni. Like, we didn't even eat breakfast. I'm so hungry. I didn't have one piece of pizza. Christmas dinner. Maybe my dinner's coming together after all. Bree's been kind enough to make it look like I know what I'm doing as well, so. I'm just gonna add that milk mixture that we did earlier. Oh my gosh. Oh, Devin, you're spilling Noodle it. down. All right, we're just gonna keep simmering. This is really hard for me to be behind the camera. <laughs> Look at that, oh my goodness. Is this gonna be the best macaroni of all time? I really don't know. <laughs> is this gonna be the end of Brianna? Macaroni, check. Green beans, check. Hi, Hi, Hi. 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 Oh, like those now, you still have to put it in the oven. Oh. Is this yeah, thing on? Pins. So Nick and Lauren are here. We've got pretty much everything done except for the main thing, the chicken and their steaks. <laughs> we have no meat, no meat is done. But we've got a full spread going on. And Lauren made some amazing asparagus. Mm -hmm. A Christmas oh, yeah. cheers. Canada dry cheers for sure. And a happy new year. Yeah. <laughs> How do we even cut this? I have no clue, just cut the whole thing in half. People are gonna judge me for my chicken cutting skill. Who cares? Like literally, what do I do? Oh, look at, oh my goodness. There the are juices, juices everywhere. running out everywhere. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be 
Here, should you this take the first bite? Time. The dinner was incredible. The chicken was so good, even though it took forever to cook. And uh, we're just cleaning everything up. We're just gonna chill, watch Christmas movies the rest of the night. Merry Christmas, guys. Merry Christmas. And we will see you next time.